Yo, what's going on? It's your boy King Jut, and I'm back again with another video, and I'm about to do another reaction. So, what I'm about to react to right now is this lady who is addicted to eating sand, people. I don't know what beach she went to and got infatuated with eating sand. I bet she should tear the hell up out of some sandpaper. So we're going to watch this video, and I'm going to react to this video, and I'm going to see what's happening here. But before I get started with this video, I need you to click the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber. Like the video, click the like button for me, and also as well, leave me a comment. And action. My name is Bria. I'm 19 years old. And I'm addicted to eating sand. I just love the crunch. I just love the crunch. The crunch of sand and wing worms. In my mouth, ring worms, not wing worms. Ring worms. You gonna have ring worms on your tongue, parasites all in your mouth from eating sand. Ew, what is wrong with you? Sand, you know what tastes good right now? A sandwich. <laughs> you don't sit your ass down. It's always good on top of food, like a seasoning or something. I've taken a tortilla chip, dipped them in sand and ate them, and it gave the chip she using the damn sand like some nacho cheese, y'all. Eating some damn sand. Just take your ass on down to the beach and have a buffet then. Golly. Crunch that I've ever got in my entire life. My favorite combination of sand is when I mix it with gum. It's just like mouth watering. Mouth watering? Sand gonna make your mouth dry. I don't understand how it's mouth watering. You eating sand on your bubble gum and chewing around, and after a while, I don't understand how you're not crushing your teeth up. Just the the feel, that rough feel, of, ugh, I don't even want to think about it. It just give me goosebumps. Think about chewing on some damn sand. Bria's addiction first developed five years ago when she accidentally got a mouthful of sand at the beach. She was instantly hooked on the crunchy texture. See, I told you, I knew it. They took her to the beach, she got turned out. I already said at the beginning, I, I had a feeling that's what happened. She went to the beach, she tripped, she slipped and fell, face first in the sand, got a mouthful of sand, and from that day on, she was addicted to eating sand for the rest of her life. This is the best sand I ever tasted. I'm gonna go home and make me a ham and cheese sand, which peanut butter and jelly sand, which when I go to my room, when I'm walking to class, when I'm reading a book. Before I go to bed, I put like a pinch in my mouth. When I wake up in the morning, there's still pieces like in my teeth. It's like leftovers. When I Leftover sand. I bet you she just go on down and get her hourglass and just doop, drink it like a protein shake. Come on, man. I found out that Bria was eating sand. And I was like, oh my gosh, that is crazy. That's she must be out of her damn mind. I don't know why she keep eating all that damn sand, girl. Nasty. When I'm craving sand, I lick my finger and then dip it inside of the sand and put it on the back of my... Man, that don't look like no sand. That look like some damn dirt to me. Look like she mistaken dirt for sand. She got so desperate that, damn, I can't find no sand. The beach is far. You know what? It's too far to go go out there to the sand. And, I mean, to the beach and get some sand. You know what? I'm going right around out here in the front yard and sweep up some of this dust, make a whole plate of dusty ass dust and eat it. It's called dust sand. Just chew it. I like the fact that it grits on my teeth. It gives it that crunch that you don't get from food. You don't get your Nestle Crunch head ass up out of here. You know that damn sand. Are you crazy? Oh my gosh. 
Bria is so dependent on that satisfying crunch, she turns to nail files when her sand supply runs low. It has like sandpaper on it that gives me the same crunch. Man, she eating them damn sandpaper bars like it's a damn Snickers bar. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Come on, man. She, what's the next, a nail filer? Shit, she gonna that mother with some sandpaper. Hey, y'all, anybody want a sandpa uh, sandpaper nachos? Anybody? Sandpaper nachos, anybody? Sorry. Put it like in the back of my teeth and just go like this. But Bria's cravings can't be. Damn, she didn't tow the baseball field up. She, you know what? Let me go on down here to the park at the baseball field. They got some good sand. That's that premium sand. Man, they got the best sand in uh, in town. I always go down there. You know the kids. They churn. They churn the sand up and make it taste good because they run on it with their baseball cleats. And it's something about the baseball cleats that stirs the sand up and makes it taste real nice and tasty like plasticky sand. Show your ass on somewhere. Satisfied with just any sand. My favorite sand is actually the sand from the playground or a park. I start by taking a handful. Then I take like the big rocks out. It's natural. It's straight from the earth. It's really good and it's really crunchy. God put this sand here for you and me to enjoy. So take advantage, man. Take advantage. Eat you some sand. Time out. Sand found outdoors is often contaminated with rubbish. So you not only are you eating rubbish, it says chemicals and animal feces. Ew! So you eating cat and dog shit and cat piss out the sand and parasite piss and ants and bugs and rodents and mice that then crawl through the field and probably shit in that sand. You just scooped up everything and put it in your mouth and ate it like it's some damn fun dip. Sit your ass down. I am worried about my sister's health. Knowing that she's eating sand off the ground, that's kind of scary. I don't know exactly what's in the sand that I eat, but I really don't care. I couldn't even imagine. Ugh, you couldn't even imagine. You over here eating parasites and bugs and ugh. Imagine if a dog, Rover, get out of that sand. Took a piss in that sand, you over here. Ooh, this sand tastes kind of zesty. Man, I like the way this got zest. That's piss. That's pissy sand that you're eating. What I would do without sand. Today, she's decided she's ready to reveal her addiction to her best friend, Precious. How do you feel about... All right, people, that's it for me. I'm pulling the plug on this one. If you're eating that much damn sand, you need to sit your sand ass down somewhere. Because I'll be the sand man. Woo! Woo! Get your ass up out of here. Eat all that damn sand. <laughs> Anybody in the mood for a sandwich? Go out there, scoop you up some sand, go to the beach, make sure you bring some of that beach sand back. That's the best, that's the best sand you can eat. You sprinkle it in there, mix it on up with your coffee, some sand, nice little sand coffee uh, mixture. It's going down. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Too long, so I had to shine These boys won't smoke like a blasting nine I left that drama in Texas I'm really trying to get on my grind I'm trying my bestest By my mama Alexis For everything that I put her through This is my message I learned my lesson for messing with people Stealing my blessings